Hey everybody, it's Stacy. Welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be filming in my Carpe Diem A5 Ringbound Planner for the week of March 12th to the 18th using the Carpe Diem inserts. I just want to quickly show you how, what last week's looks like. So it's currently Saturday and I love this kit. Like how beautiful are these colors together? The pink, the green, I love it. I think it's turning out so, so pretty. So this week we are going to be using a kit from my shop called Choose Your Own Path. This kit, honestly, I was very scared to post in my shop just because it's a little bit different, a little bit out there, and the colors are a little bit crazy, but I love it. Guys, and I'm thinking you guys are too because I've seen a lot of awesome feedback from it. So I want to quickly show you what it looks like. You got your full boxes, your arrows, your weekend banner, two habit trackers, some bill dues, some flags, uh, ombre heart checklist, sidebar banners, canceled, rescheduled, and some functional, more functional washi strips, bottom washi date covers, three heart checklist, uh, teardrops, scallop boxes, sidebar headers, headers, little things. Uh, circle icons, half boxes, quarter boxes, and leg boxes. You guys, I'm kind of out of it today. I'm sorry, so that's maybe why my, yeah, it's it's been a crazy week. Okay, so I always like to start with my bottom washi. We'll do that first, and you guys, okay. This is so, so pretty. Like these colors, I can't get over them. I hope you guys love them too. And I think it would just be such a fun, you know what, last week I put this too low and I didn't like that. So let's make sure we center this more. There, that's better. It's a little bit crooked. Okay. So this week, if you haven't watched my Erin Condren video, you'll know already, is a very special week because it is my daughter's birthday week. She turns four this week. I cannot believe it. It's insane that I am gonna have a four-year-old, but she is turning four. We cannot wait. She's gonna have a Disney princess themed birthday party and she is gonna have a blast. Okay, so I'm gonna use this quote box here for the very top of my sidebar. Do some washi and my habit trackers. So my daughter picked like the easiest birthday party to have ever. Uh, where did I put the, oh, right here. Cause usually I make cakes for people sometimes, like I decorate them. I took like a little course um, at Michael's and I just decided to I, I wanted to do a hobby and That's what I did for a while. I was just doing it for fun So like if friends or family needed cakes, I would do them I've done three weddings now and it's just very fun. So I'm not very good, but it is very fun the same so usually when my kids Have a birthday then I make their cake so my son just had his birthday in December, so he had a Paw Patrol birthday. So I made this like big cake that looked like a bone. It was very cute, but I'm used to doing that. And she, I asked her for any, whatever birthday you, or sorry, birthday cake you want, I will make for you. And she told me she wanted a Dairy Queen ice cream cake. So my daughter, she's so sweet and she, I don't know, she just thought mom needed a break, so she picked like the easiest cake ever to make, because all I have to do is phone. So that's what we are having, Dairy Queen ice cream cake. So, yeah, I'm very excited for her birthday. And then decorations too, like how easy is it to find decorations for Disney Princess? They're like everywhere. So it's, oh yeah, it's gonna be such an easy, easy birthday to do, but I am very excited. Okay, 
So for my sidebar, I just did this choose your own path quote box at the top. I layered washi and some um, habit trackers. I just interchanged them. Just did the solid blue navy for the middle to kind of tone down the sidebar a little bit. I did this heart washi here, did my t t clean header and a three heart checklist, an odds and ends header and a three heart checklist, and my dinner's header, and then a full, um, oh, that's not the right one. This is supposed to be like a weekly bar. Oops. Oops, oops, oops. That's okay. Let's do the navy. Easy to change. Okay, so that's my sidebar. We're gonna move right into Monday now. So Monday is my daughter's birthday, but the first thing I like to do for every day is put these today headers at the top. And then I'll just do it also for Friday. There we go. Okay, so first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna do a half box for my daughter's birthday. Very special day. And then we're gonna take the balloons from the kit. We're having her party on her actual birthday. So it's just gonna be perfect to mark that. Okay. Uh, and then I'm going to put a scallop box here to mark that it is my cleaning day. And then I'm going to take the little spray bottle from the kit. Here it is. There we go. And then I'm going to do a full box. Uh, let's do this one. And then I'm gonna do my checklist all the way at the bottom. Um, no. So I'll do my to-do header there. And then this blue checklist for my to-do list. Um, and then the only other thing I wanna put in here is that my sister is gonna come down and I'm going to help her with her homework. I've mentioned this before, but she's taking um, she's taking like a business management um, degree course, and one of the things she has to take is accounting. And I took accounting in college, so I'm just gonna put this little icon here with the book. And so I've been helping her with her homework just to kind of understand it a little bit better. And then for Tuesday, I'm gonna put a full box. Let's do. Pink one. So she comes over and does her homework on those days. And it's just nice to see her too. Okay, um, Tuesday I want to mark that uh, is going to be my mother in law's birthday dinner. Uh, let's do this color. And then I'm going to take the eat out sticker from the kit. And I was also gonna do um, this little present here. That's a lot of pink. Okay, I'm changing my mind. And, oh, come on. I'm gonna put this at the bottom. Oops, sorry. Let's put this at the bottom. I just don't want that much pink all in one little section. Let's do my to-do list next. Do the navy. And then on Tuesday, I also wanna put my little things at the bottom again. Those have been really helping me remember what things are what. So I'll put that for $2 Tuesday. And I also want to put that it's a work day. So I'm going to take um, the work script stickers from my shop, these guys here, and I'm just going to put it 
Um, let's just put it right at the top here so that I know that it's a work day. And also, I think I'm just gonna leave the rest of this blank because I know I'll fill it with something. So we'll just leave it blank for now. Wednesday, the kids have an eye doctor appointment in the morning. So let's take um, this blue uh, arrowed and we're just gonna move it down a little bit because I found this appointment sticker in my paper crown planner kit that I had left over and I'm just gonna stick it on top here and then we'll just take the stethoscope and we'll put it underneath okay. there and then I'll just mark the time the kids have their eye appointments and also on Wednesday is soccer registration. I am so excited for that. My daughter has never, like she's not old enough to do any of the activities in our area yet. So when she, she this, is, this will be her first time and I'm very excited. So I'm gonna put this little car icon here in this half box to mark that. And then I'll do a full box right away. And let's do the heart. Or should we do, yeah, let's do the chevron pattern. And then I'll do my to-do list at the very bottom. Um, and then this red color, oh man. I feel like this, <laughs> Poor sticker cannot figure out where the best spot is for it. I wonder if I should just change it. Okay, let's put this guy down first. And then let's do this blue and white polka dot sticker. Oh, come on. Here we go. And let's put this eat out sticker back on there. And the present. There. Sorry, guys. I feel like that was a long workaround. But that's cute. Okay. I like that. So on Wednesday is also my grocery shopping day. So let's take the grocery shopping stickers from my shop. And we'll just stick it. Hmm. Let's use some of this solid blue washi and we'll just layer it. I think that's cute. Okay. So. Thursday is another work day, so let's do my to-do list. Um, I wanted to do my to-do list at the top, but all I have is work day. Um, let's do a full box first. We'll do this guy, and then my to-do list, and then this light pink checklist, and then I'm going to take the work script sticker again and just stick it Again at the top of this full box just to mark that it's my work day and I don't know anything else for Thursday yet so I'm just gonna leave it blank so moving on to the second half of the week on Friday is um, a day that I want to film so let's take a scallop sticker 
And let's take the, like this filming icon here. And we'll just mark that I want to film. And it's also going to be new release day. So I'll put uh, this little alarm clock here at the bottom. Oh, Wednesday is also so uh, plan with me. So I'll just put that in there with a TV little thing. Sorry. So I just put this alarm clock here for new releases. And I'm going to put that Etsy sticker, this guy here from my shop, and just put it on top of the alarm clock to mark that it's new releases. And let's do a checklist right away. So I'll do my to-do header and a light blue checklist. And then I'm going to put my full box at the bottom. And I'm going to use this navy one. There we go. Pretty crooked. There we go. Um, for Friday, that's all I really know so far. The only thing I know is I always like to do my nails before I plan. So I'm going to put this little nail polish sticker in my to-do list. And that's all I'm going to put for now for Friday. For Saturday and Sunday, I'm going to put some washi strips at the top and then put my weekend banner. Oops. So I'll just put the same two washi strips at the top and then take this weekend banner from the kit and layer that on there. And then I'm gonna do a full box for Saturday right away. super cute heart one and Saturday is St. Patrick's Day so let's take a full or sorry a half box for that oops and I'm just gonna write it in and then I'll do my checklist and let's do this guy and on Sunday is church so we're gonna use these church stickers from my shop and I thought the pink one would be cute and on Sunday is also a bill do put this bill do sticker in there and a plan with me is going live on Tuesday so we'll put this TV little thing at the very bottom. And I wanted to put my checklist first. And then I'm gonna do the navy check bar. And then my last full box. And then I'll leave this bottom section open for things that come up. But this is how the kit is looking so far. You guys can see that okay. I love it. I think it's turning out so cute so far. So now I'm going to go in and put my date covers on. And I'm going to fill everything in with my Tombow calligraphy pen. And I'll be right back. Alright guys, so I am back. I have put my date covers on and filled everything out and I am in love, you guys. I think it's turning out so, so pretty. I am so happy with it. So I'm just going to show you what I have left in the kit. I have a couple functional and washi strips, some arrows, some flags, a bill do, one check box and a weekly bar, some functional and some cancelled, bunch of little things and headers, teardrops, scallops. Um, half boxes, quarter boxes, and a ton of icons. So if you like this video, please don't, um, please give it a big thumbs up. 
Do not forget to subscribe. Leave any questions or comments you have down below. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye!